King Vinvar. Why? Constantine didn't do anything. He has never sought to wrong your people in any way. Like a worm, he burrows. You are so naive. You cannot see with my eyes. An old Milfrichtimin saw the wound. From atop the volcano, he warned me of the danger. Fed by bitterness, driven by desire. Taking without giving, he will be the end of us all. You have gone completely mad. Take it. You are too blind, too renaixe to understand. Leave him! Let's go see him, quick. Constantine! Wake up, please! I beg you! Hang on. We're bringing you home to get you healed. Three days have passed since we returned. I need to go to the palace to see if Constantine has finally awoken. You're not being reasonable. To hell with reason. I've rested long, and I'm well enough. You've just barely woken from a stupor that had you on death's doorstep. The affairs of state can certainly wait another day. Let... <sighs> Thank you, my lady, but I am amazingly well. You can take leave of me with no fear, I assure you.
He just escaped a deathly sleep, and here he is ready to conquer the world. Your cousin is exasperating. <sighs> what now? Are you going to scold me as well? No, no, no. I'm, I'm just relieved to see you're still alive. <sighs> I'm quite relieved myself, actually. Thank you, cousin. Without you, I would be dead thrice, wouldn't I? Or is it the fourth time? If we start counting the time you stop me from climbing the ramparts of Serene, we'd be up to five times now. It's unbelievable. You feel no pain whatsoever. And your complexion. <sighs> I haven't even taken a look at myself. Is the improvement visible? I wouldn't go that far. How is it that... What happened? Don't make that face. It's merely a major miracle. Come on now. I'm gonna tell you everything. We have been waiting for your return. I knew you would do everything in your power. I have always trusted you, but Katasak feared that I would not hold on long enough. He spoke to me about a ritual that would help me. I was excited about it, and in spite of all that has happened, I don't regret following him. We went to the ancient site, a place full of magic. I followed his instructions, and all of a sudden, what an incredible sensation. I felt better than I have ever felt, cousin. Alas, we had very little time to celebrate. Cries came to our ears, and beasts jumped all over us. We fled for a while, as other soldiers fought through, creating a path to join us. But I can see from your face that you know this already. Indeed. Once on the ritual site, I followed your tracks and deduced what had happened. Tell me more about this ritual. What did it consist of? It is, I think, a ritual that the Donegada practice to bind themselves to the island. Donegada? Katasak taught you their language? Just a few words. He wanted me to learn, to understand, but we had so little time. So he visited this infamous site, where he prepared for me a sort of potion. What ceremony? I had to cut my hand in front of an enormous stone, and there, a gigantic beast came and started circling around me. It was incredible. I truly felt a bond with that place. Like a wave came through me, as if the power of the island was running through my veins. It was marvelous. And now I am on all Manawi, like you. Even if the Malachor left me a few of its marks. It seems that Vinbar was targeting you specifically. Did he say anything to you? I was still very weak, and most of the time he whispered in his own language. It seemed that he was speaking to someone and following his orders. But there was no one other than us, cousin. The crazy madman must have been hearing voices. Do you have any idea why he didn't kill you like the others? No. No, not really. It seemed like he was trying to tell me something, though. He spoke about isolating me from the world, that I couldn't return to the Earth. It made absolutely no sense. But aren't you happy that he let me live? Don't speak foolishly, of course. I just want to understand. But you had to encounter the god of the island, didn't you? How was Enon Mil Frichterman? Yes, I passed a trial for that. But the only one who could guide me to the sanctuary is dead. Oh no. Do not tell me. And yes, only the High King can open the sanctuary according to Glendan. I have no choice but to return to see him. I'm certain they're going to name a successor.